Hi viewers, this is Mohan Vamsi Pentakota. I'm a data warehousing and business intelligence consultant. In this video, I'm going to explain how to restart intelligence server services in MicroStrategy on Windows machine. There are five ways to restart intelligence server services on a Windows machine. The first way is click on the project source and in the administration menu, select server and you have the choices stop server and start server. Another way is click on start menu, go to all programs, click on MicroStrategy tools, look for service manager, click on service manager, and here you can stop, restart, and start intelligent server services. Another option is click on run. Type services.msc. Click on services.msc application. You can also access services.msc application under control panel administration tools. Now search for MicroStrategy Intelligent Server. And here either you can stop and start service or restart the service. Another way of doing this is open, click on command manager, it will ask you to log into the project source, select the appropriate project source and provide the login ID and password, click on OK. For example, if you are not aware of your MicroStrategy Intelligent Server name, you can always use list servers to list out the MicroStrategy server name. You can execute the command. You can execute the command by clicking on connection on the menu and clicking on execute. And the shortcut is control plus E. And once you are aware of the server name, put that server name in this area. And the syntax is restart server in, in between double quotes, put the server name and a semicolon. Select the whole code and execute. And that will restart the intelligent server service. The last and final way is we can restart MicroStrategy intelligent server service from command prompt. Open the command prompt in Windows. The executable file I'm going to discuss right now will reside in this location. MSTRCTL S. So this is the syntax to start a service from command line. If you want to stop a service from command line, so this is the syntax to stop the service from a command line. Thanks for watching my videos. Feel free to ask questions.